herbicide application is a means to improve the vegetation and reduce the mowing cycles. We're eliminating the invasive species that are not native to Birmingham, Alabama, and improving the turf at the same time. Right now we're in the reclamation phase. We want to be in the maintenance phase next year and that's part of it. And, and yes, there are, there are good and bad with everything. There's aesthetic brownout, but there's also green grass up underneath those brown weeds and that's ultimately what we want. And that's where the combination of herbicides and the timing of the mowing really plays a big part. The herbicides are very selective. I will write a prescription based on the, the site. Um, we work in conjunction. There's a lot of cooperation between the mowing crews and our spray crews where we may go out and spray a site prior to mowing cycle to get the timing right. We may spray something after. Um, could be a week, it could be a month, where we want to catch it at the ideal point to maximize the mowing. Herbicides will never replace mowing. It's a um, process of determining with herbicides and treatments how can we minimize the mowing cycles and still get the, the most bang for the city's buck as far as mowing and spraying together. The herbicide application program um, on average is about 10% the cost of a mowing cycle and it, the herbicide treatment is as good as two to four mowing cycles depending on what's, what's established already as far as turf but there is a, an immense reduction in cost while improving the turf. So we're extending the life of the equipment. We're, we're covering more ground and being more efficient with our crews. Herbicides are extremely safe. One of the main products that we use is Roundup that everybody uses in their yard. But we're using six to eight ounces of Roundup per acre. And an acre is a field 208 feet by 208 feet. That's a huge area for only six or eight ounces, so it's extremely safe. The herbicide application and, and Mayor Bell's cleanup efforts for the entire city, this is a big part of the puzzle because I've already noticed in my short time here that we've sprayed several sites where there were areas that were so overgrown that the community could not maintain those areas themselves. Now that we've sprayed it, they're actually going back out and maintaining it. So the community is actually buying into the process of, we're helping them, we're helping the community have more pride in their neighborhoods.